Hello everyone, welcome back to Atlas Fallen. Uh, we're up here on top of the giant rock thing. Um, I'm gonna try to find the treasure map locations. I uh, went to go look them up, but I couldn't really find anywhere where I could see just like a picture of where they are. And I, I have a, I have, I can't stand watching like other people's videos for shit, so. I'm just gonna try to either find them myself, or I'm just gonna not find them. How do I get to that? That's just scary, I really don't want to fall. Let's see what this does. It probably just leads me around, but... I don't know. I don't know what's happening. either come over here or I'm gonna leave dude I'm not fighting you over there where I can fall This essence we have been accumulating to use. You know, you would think when I turned that off to like rarely, it wouldn't fucking remind me to use my essence to upgrade when I'm three quarters of the way through the game, but you know. What do I know about about that sort of thing? Like like do people get like three quarters of the way through video games and just not and not realize they can upgrade? Like, there's somebody on the first playthrough of, like, Dark Souls. I think I learned how these essence stones are formed. The wraiths come from the sands. This is obvious. But they need to channel the power of Thelos. I thought there was something up here. When a wraith is slain, it sometimes falters. And the power of Thelos condenses into an object. And this object looks like a stone full of otherworldly powers. An essence stone. It also seems to have something to do with the size of a wraith. Massively increases the restoration rate of your idol when it has no charges left. That seems kind of stupid. I wonder if the essence stone a huge wraith leaves behind is different from others. I don't really know what the point of using that would be. Now we're too far up, I guess. Uh, did I get one of them? Oh, was that it? That was like the lamest treasure it could have possibly given me. Um, okay, well that was not worth my time. Which one is left? Holding Heaven. This one, I have no idea. Oh, right here. Literally right here, I see. Okay, perfect. I was gonna say, I have no idea where this one is. I looked for it for a while, but... I didn't, obviously, get up here. Could I have even gotten up here? Without... Oh, I guess I could have right here. Ah, uh, yeah, that, that was pretty tucked away, actually. There's so many of these holes, I wouldn't have even known that, like, that was one I could... I should go into. Okay, let's see. Where was that other quest I wanted to do? Not the apple one. I still want to, I, I mean, I do want to do the apple one. I thought there was another blue one that I needed to do. Oh, right, I did it in the last one. I forgot. I did it by mistake in the last one. Okay. 
That's fine. Perfect. In that case, since we've got the treasure, let's just go ahead and, uh... We'll, um... Save. And then we'll go do some... We'll, we'll go do some stuff in the new zone. That rock is... Yeah, 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 yeah. The rock, yeah, yeah. It is yeah, let me get a save game going. That way, if it crashes or something, or if I lose the footage, I can just revert back and... And do it over again. Fortunately, I, I haven't had to do that yet. Um, I mean, it obviously crashed, but I didn't really lose the footage. Um, what am I doing? Fast traveling. Here we go. Yeah, fortunately, I haven't had to, you know, like redo stuff for the sake of recording it to put on YouTube. Um, I'm sure that'll happen at some point. If not during this playthrough, then, you know. Eventually, it will happen to me, I'm sure. I'll lose footage and have to reduce shit, but... Till then, it's good that Listen I have all these voice. saves. That way I can... Breathing. Ah, gauntlet bearer. Can I interest you in some new... Ah, okay. gauntlet Monks, he's wonderful. If you find all the... Oh, I thought Let you were gonna, like, offer me shit, bro. Find the ancient armor pieces. Take okay. care of yourself. Not just of others. I forgot I was supposed to talk to her last time I was here. I am relieved to see you here, Gauntlet Bearer. We saw the explosion, but had to keep... I see that you did your best. What can we do now? We were... somewhat unprepared. But we have no time to... My scouts can't get close to the central altar. There's a barrier of some sort. There are also two strange beams lighting the sky. When you're there, perhaps you can check how my... I hope they found out more. Okay. I'll get going now. We're counting. We'll, uh, we'll find those knights for sure. Oh, so you do get a thousand extra. This is it then. In a way, my entire life has been nothing but a preparation for the coming battle. I wish that were a comfort. I see fear in the One women the and men's eyes. Me they stumbled upon Loss here means oblivion. But worse still, it means an end. To the knights, to revolution, for centuries to come. Without the gauntlet bearer, we would never have made it this far, and victory would remain an impossibility. But I trust them, and this is it. Our last chance to create a world free from oppression. We will win. I know it. We have to. What I was saying is, you do get a thousand uh, bonus essence when you just do the optional objectives, so that's nice. Alright, track her. Oh, I already talked to her, actually. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you stay safe. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Let's see what this lady has to sell. Why don't you take a look at my wares? Ooh. Queen's cover. Your weapon hits have a small chance to create a small area healing you and your ally for five seconds. That's kind of cool. I'll definitely buy that. Getting hit by a momentum drainer will crystallize the attacking foe. After shattering, leave behind an area of effects greatly slowing foes into projectiles. Interesting. Pick that up. Pick up that map. Watch your back when you go out there. I think no human ever wanted this. What is that? Is that a chest? Or no, that's a pathway. Okay. Let's see where this takes us. Is that gonna take us all the way over there? I'd be shocked if it did.
we got? Something juicy? Uh, launch a projectile damaging and crystallizing a foe on impact. An explosion is sent out on impact with a high chance to crystallize hit foes. That does seem pretty dang good, I'm not gonna lie. Um, do I have something here that I could replace that would give me more damage? Yeah, I do. Ooh. Hmm. When you get hit, send out an explosion. Huh. Thing is, I'd have to get rid of. Well, I could. I could get rid of that. I guess. The orb, I, li I do like the orb thing, but it doesn't do a lot of damage, although at a small chance to crystallize your foe, the chance is better the longer you hold an attack. Ooh, well, then again, that, let me upgrade the orb and see how good that is when it's upgraded. Okay. What's this? Totem. I spotted the traveling vendor. You have some tributes, right? We should take a break. Oh my gosh, it's a far one. right there. Say that a lot recently to a lot of different folks. But this one's the hardest. I'm sorry, Val. I ran. When the knights needed me the most, when Kendra needed me, I ran. Not in fear. In guilt. But you. You never ran. You kept your beliefs until the end. And I wasn't there to see it through. For what it's worth, I'm going to change things. Here, now. We're closer now to our goal than ever before, and I want... No. I need to see it through. Me and Kendra, we balance each other out. And that's why we're going to win. For you. For everyone. We have to. All right, I did not mean to cut uh, what's his face off there, but whatever. Ooh, treasure map, I'll take it. I'll take it. Let's go back and get that chest we saw on our way over here. Oh, that does remind me. Actually, I for I need a I need a good look and and see what all I can upgrade here. I've been I keep forgetting to do this, and then I'm like late game, and then don't have any of this shit upgraded. What did I just? Okay, I just upgraded something by mistake. I think I thought I was upgrading this. Okay, that's maxed. Um. Increases a chance. Let's do that. 
Send out an explosion. Increases the damage of my shatter. Let's do that. Let's get that max as well. The attacking foe receives damage. Let's get that as well. Let's get that. Spend all all of my essence here, but that's nah, fine. Increases the damage dealt by the explosion. Sure. So we just need to get Ossid right to get that upgraded, but I haven't even tried that yet, so I probably shouldn't upgrade it until I know it's going to be useful. Okay, so I got a bunch of upgrades coming in, so that's that's pretty dang good. And what is my armor level at? I'm at 11, so the ar new armor I just got fully upgraded isn't going to be like higher level than this one is. Obviously, obviously that doesn't mean like it, it can't be better, but. I think the effect on the new one, like the special effect when I get it maxed, is better. Okay. Careful. The haze from the tower hides the quicksand. Are you sure? I mean, it's not really that hidden, honestly. Right and silvery this ore, okay. Really annoying. This is quicksand. We must escape it. I mean, it's not even that big of a deal. Relax. It's not even like a poison swamp. Um, where is this chest at? See something right there. Wait, hold on. I gotta go back this way because I have to go get that other chest I saw. Oh. Okay, well, we found that. Is there a watchtower near here? Oh, there is. Literally right there. Okay. Okay. Well, we'll go try that after we get this chest. I mean, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what, like, level the actual boss enemies are gonna be in this zone. I mean, those guys were still level 8, but they were just kind of basic bitches, so. Perform a spinning attack, damaging nearby targets in a large area. Okay, so like spin to win. Whipper up there. Pale root. It's all that was in that, really?
Seems a bit strange. Watch it be a thing like those pale roots all this time or something that I could eat that increases my like max health permanently. To be honest, I mean, I never did like I'm never looking at any of this shit, so it could have been. Uh, dig up a little for yeah. Uh, no. I don't think any of these are like consumable. Let's go try this watchtower, I guess. I'm a little bit worried, but assuming I can, I can even do it right now. Ooh, I see it here. I haven't fought one of those guys in a while. Do I really want to fight that guy now, though? Probably not. Probably should wait till I clear the watchtower out. The watchtower is probably going to be filled with, like, flying enemies, if I had to guess. Maybe a couple on the ground. Yourself. I'm scared. Fear. I haven't found one of these guys in a while. Yeah, I got to take those off, man. It's just... Any, any projectile-based zone is just gonna not work. The, the game is just not. It's just too good for it. Like, real, like maybe... And, like, like, unless they're shattered... It just seems like it's complete RNG whether or not it actually hits, and then even if, even when they're shattered, you have to just trust that uh, the game isn't going to auto target to you onto something else when you don't want it. To. Pick that, sir. Stop that. Okay, and we're targeted on. Oh my gosh, man. Luckily, it still hits. Luckily, it's like an AoE. I have a feeling it's probably not going to be like full damage. I thought I. That one I defended. Can you just stop walking? Like, what are you doing? A 
that tickled me compared to the first one that I fought. Okay, can I, I guess he's just perpetually stuck against the wall. You're not, you don't have the technology to get him from the wall to the center of the arena where I can actually damage him. Clear sight achievement. Um, cleared all watchtowers in the game. Oh, damn! I had no idea that I was already done with the watchtowers. If I, I thought I had at least a few more to do in this zone. The first zone had one. The second zone had three, I think. So I figured this one would have like four or five. But I'll take it. Now I get to go fight the uh, fever. Quickening Venom, your active stones have a significantly shorter cooldown, but drain a small amount of your health on use. Okay. So I see that traveling man. He might have something we need. Where was Well, first let's go take care of this heaver. Okay, what, fighting these guys in the quick turn is not, um, not as easy. I'm gonna get hit by that. Finish him. 1900 essence. I'll take it. I, I honestly don't even know if that shit is called essence, but I've just been calling it that um, the entire game. So, whatever. Alright, where was the... Where's the traveling vendor? I can go to him. Where was the thing with those chests that I saw? Was it right here? My compass does say there's chests nearby, so it might be right here. Well, let me go to the vendor real quick. Before I forget. Oh yeah, it was right here though. Okay. Let's see, what do we got? Uh, reduces the aggressiveness of your foes for 8 seconds. That's kind of interesting. Just straight up chill chills them all out. 
Get some stoned. That genuinely might genuinely might be pretty cool. Um, okay, let me see what he Selling wants. All kinds of now it no time to talk. I want to trade. Yeah, let me see what you got, bro. Right now, hurling lands, yada yada, same old shit. Old what is this? Crystallize your foe. It's not an explosion. Yeah, it's just the same old crap. Okay. Okay. So let's go see what was over here. Scatter that I see guarding that. Dude, that upgrade for the orb seems like it's basically always... I mean, it probably isn't always, but it almost seems like it always uh, leaves a little. Just kind of nuts. I wonder if I don't trigger that. Like, does it, do I get it eventually? Probably not. It probably just despawns after a while. Let's go fight the scatter before I lose too much momentum. Actually, you know what? Fuck it. now. Open up with this. Oh, <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Damn! Motherfucker didn't stand a chance, dude! <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Jesus. That poor thing just. just got demolished. There's nothing left. <laughs> oh my gosh. It was nuts. I almost feel bad for it. Okay, let's see. What's in this like a deserted ass town? Ooh. Something right there. Hidden path. What's up here? I saw something, yeah, let's see. Old coin. Great. Just what I always wanted. My character's probably carrying around like 15 pounds of old coins. What time is it? Uh, okay, I'm gonna end the episode here in just a moment. Man, I was I was legit a little bit like a little bit like like oh gosh, you know. I have to fight the stupid scatter, but might as well just get a head start on the damage, you know, it's gonna be rough, but at least we'll have that, you know. And then I just one shot at the bitch. Is this all that was up here? Oh, I got a map, I see that. Okay. Are you going to remember all the locations of the treasures? Definitely, dude. Let us mark some of them on our Why map. wouldn't I remember? It's so easy to rem remember everything. Alright. What is this? Uh, we can do this real quick and then 
call it a call it a day. Oh, am I gonna have to raise something? Hopefully not. Saw an item up there. Swamp ruins. When this is over, I hope it can be rebuilt. It's gonna be a poison swamp? What is it? Once. Silas and I were united. No. Work together. Very much not. It feels like shame. One could only dream. I actually don't like poison swamps all that much in Dark Souls, but I don't mind them. Like the thing is, I like vibrant colors in games, or just with anything, and so a lot of the like poison swamps I don't like just because of the color palette. But like in Elden Ring when you were in the Lake of Rot. Like, that was a cool-ass zone. I, I loved it because it was just so not Poison Swamp looking, even though by, you know, it was a Poison Swamp. Um, very small chance for active stones not to go on cooldown. I don't really care about that, honestly. Ooh, so. I don't know what that is, but... An anvil right there. Let me get um, whatever this is. Oh, is that another path? Oh, we can do that. I keep saying, like, oh, we'll do this and then we'll end. Oh, we'll do that and then we'll end. But for real, though, this will be the last one. Right after we go to that uh, anvil, of course. Oh, no! The dream! Think. Yeah. Ooh. A piece of armor. This oh, that was one of the Smith was armor pieces about. I need. Needed. Cool. There must be more. We could look for them. No. Give it to me. Okay. Writing tool. Okay, so let's go and get the um, anvil, and then we'll end it there. What we got? Just some some basic bitch shit. Okay. We can rest and grow stronger there. Alrighty. Okay, so in the next episode, we're gonna go deeper into the zone and see if. I'm curious to find all the. I really wanna find all the armor pieces because I'm curious to see what armor it gives me. I'm assuming he's gonna put them all together and I'm gonna get some really cool armor. So maybe we'll do that in the next episode. So thank you everybody so much for watching and I'll catch y'all in the next one.